Ja jestem Leszek Borysiewicz, rektor Uniwersytetu w Cambridge w Wielkiej Brytanii. Today has been a very special day at the University of Cambridge in this uh, event of recognizing the gift of the Sierpiński tree. We are very happy that we can have Sierpiński tree here, especially next to the Faculty of Mathematics. The Sierpiński tree underlies an important principle that here was a basic piece of work that was done that is only seeing its true benefits in the mathematics uh, of today. And its location between the Institute of Mathematics and the Newton Institute actually portrays where it rightly sits. Some people whom I have met here knew Sierpiński, so they remember him and his achievements. It was in 1915 that he was researching on topological properties of curves. He constructed a curve with the property that every point of it was actually at the end of three disjoint arcs of the curve. He started it at large scale and got smaller and smaller, and the curve filled a shape which looks like a number of triangles of a large size and then many more triangles of smaller size joined together. And this, these days, is known as the Szczepinski Triangle. A very natural extension to an object in three-dimensional space is what we call the Szczepinski Tetrahedron, which consists of four tetrahedra, one sitting on top of the other three, and then again you have this self-similarity. From there, it is but a short step to introduce a branch and sub-branches that join up the parts to get the Sipinski tree. Many areas of mathematics are very much dependent on the work that has been done in Poland. Polish mathematics continues to have an enormous impact. The relationships between the University of Cambridge and Poland are hugely important. Many of the linkages that we have are very real and very active today. We have a teaming proposal together with the Wrocław University of Technology. I have direct bridges with the Jagiellonian University in Krakow, particularly in life sciences. We have linkages with the University of Warsaw, also in Gdańsk and uh, Łódź as well. These are really important because at the end of the day we live in a very small planet and working together we can solve many global problems. Poland is by far the largest of the new member states of the European Union, so it's an important market for the United Kingdom going forward. Secondly, it's uh, geostrategic significance and that's become increasingly clear over the last few years, so that's why I think the study of Poland is particularly important to Britain. Besides the fact that it's a fascinating subject worthy of study, uh, in, in itself. I thought it was a privilege to be part of the pioneering <laughs> course at Cambridge studying Polish. Living in a country where we have lots of Polish people coming in, we really don't know anything about their own past. It really opens your eyes to what lies beyond kind of our concepts of Western Europe. It's been so much fun plunging into like a history you've never even considered before from an Eastern perspective. I think it's been a really interesting opportunity. The main purpose of this new pilot program in Polish Studies uh, at Cambridge, first of all, to introduce a new generation of British students uh, to the history of Polish culture and to the Polish language. Secondly, to have a broader impact, we organize a series of special events which are open to the public. We can see ourselves almost in a, in a promotional role for Poland, but also at the forefront of new innovative approaches to teaching and researching Polish culture. Here at Cambridge University we have Polish students, more than 200 students here. In the UK there are around 8,000 Polish students right now. I think that it's a great number and we are creating a wonderful community. The Cambridge University Polish Society was created in 2008. Every year we are organising a range of events aimed to promote Polish scientists, Polish students here in Cambridge. The most important initiative is probably Science Polish Perspectives Conference. Apart from that, we are 
organizing Next to Poland conference. It aimed to bring along Polish students interested in their career in Poland, as well as Polish employers who promote opportunities for Polish students, as well as show that actually in Poland there are as many challenges and as many great places to work at as here in England. We need uh, such fantastic Polish students here in Britain and we hope they will come back to Poland.